How do you preload Modern Warfare 3 open beta or just the beta on PC? Well, I've seen the answer a lot of times for Activision, which I'll show you in just a moment. But for Steam, which I've seen nobody touch on, here's how you preload MW3 on Steam specifically. Simply open up Steam, search for Call of Duty in your library, right click it, choose properties. And on the DLC tab, if you scroll all the way to the bottom and you see Modern Warfare 3, followed by any packs, if you have the more expensive editions, make sure that all of these are ticked and if they weren't ticked you'll have a download to complete to preload the open beta or just the beta. The download should have already completed. Once you have these ticked you can close this and try to play the game. It may only now detect that there's an update to download and it could take some time but eventually the game should start up and in order to play it when it actually comes out all you need to do is scroll down on the main menu until you see this section here where you can then choose Modern Warfare 3 or of course they could bring this up upon release as of course it's one of the more important events. So the first screen is the highlights, second screen Modern Warfare 3, scrolling down further MW2 etc. Now as for whether preload is actually enabled just yet, that's a completely different story. I do remember downloading an update but of course they may actually be no preload on Steam, just as long as you have those options ticked then you should be able to play it as soon as the beta begins. Anyways, that's for Steam. For Activision Blizzard, the steps are different. In Battle.net, all you need to do is navigate your way to the game. I don't own it here, but I can head across to Call of Duty. Usually you'll have a play button in the bottom left. All you need to do is look right below that. There should be some text that says download pre-release content. Simply clicking that will cause Modern Warfare 3 to preload. On top of this, you may also see under Call of Duty on the right hand side here, Modern Warfare 3 beta available. If you were to click that, a new menu pops up where you can make sure that Modern Warfare 3 open beta is selected here. Upon saving it, 10 gigs will be downloaded and of course, you'll be able to play Modern Warfare 3 open beta or just the beta as soon as it happens, which is in a very short amount of time. If you'd like to save space, you can untick other parts of Modern Warfare 2 that you wouldn't like to keep anymore, such as the campaign, and those will be removed. Anyways, that's really about it for this super quick guide. Hopefully you found this somewhat useful. My name's been Troubleshoot and I'll see you all next time. Ciao!